from page 85 of Helter Skelter, Helter Skelter by Vincent Belowski. I'm playing Virginia and Susan Atkins. Yes, that's Susan Atkins. Sexy Sadie. How did you know their names? We didn't. Not until the next day. At one point, the group split up. I went to the bed room, a while the others stayed downstairs in the living room. Sharon was sitting up in bed. Jay was sitting on the edge of the bed talking about to Sharon. Oh, really? What did she have on? She had a bikini bra and panties. You're kidding. And she was pregnant? Yeah. And they looked up and they were surprised. Wow. Wasn't there some kind of hassle? No, they were too surprised. And they knew we meant business. Why'd you put a head over Sepik's head? We didn't put a head on it over his head. That's what the paper said. That's what the paper said, Sadie. Well, there wasn't any hood. He was full of blood. I stabbed him three or four times. He was bleeding and he ran out from part. And would you believe all that hollering, help, help, somebody help me, please, please. Nobody came. Was Sharon the last one to die? <laughs> I held Sharon's arms behind her. And she looked at me crying, begging, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I don't want to die. I want to live. I want to have my baby. I want to have my baby. I looked Sharon straight in the eye and said, look, bitch, I don't care about you. I don't care if you're going to have a baby. I don't. You had better been ready. You're going to die and you're not going to feel anything about it. Two minutes, I killed her she, and she was dead. After killing Sharon, I noticed that there's blood on her hand. I tasted it. Wow, what a trip. I thought to taste death and yet give life. Has she ever tasted blood? It's warm, sticky, and nice. <laughs> kind of bothered you to kill Sharon Tate with her pregnant. Well, I thought you understand. I loved her and in order for me to kill her, I was killing Pop myself whenever I killed her. Oh yeah, I do understand. I want to cut off the baby, but there hadn't been enough time. I wanted to take their eyes out, people, and squash them against the walls and cut off their fingers. <laughs> we were going to mutilate them, but we didn't have enough time. There wasn't a chance to. How did you feel about the murders? I felt so elated, tired, but at peace with myself. I knew that this was just the beginning of Helter Skelter. Now the world will listen. Keep her voice down. I'm not worried about that. <laughs> I'm pretty good at being cra playing crazy. <laughs> After we left the Tate residence, I discovered that she had lost her knife. I lost my knife. I thought the dog was gone too or something. You know how dogs are sometimes? It dawned over me afterwards. But my spear was so strong that obviously it didn't show up. Or they would have had me by now. So apparently you changed clothes in the car. Then driven at some distance stopping at a place where there's a fountain or water outside to wash your hands. A small man came outside and just wanted to know what we were doing. He started to holler at them and guess who he was. I, I don't know. He was a sheriff of Beverly Hills. There, Beverly Hills doesn't have a sheriff. Well, the sheriff or mayor or something. The man started to reach into the car to grab teas and Charlie turned on the key. Boy, we made it. We laughed all the way. 
You can't let me down. You know. <laughs> the other two the next night. Was that you? What do you think? But that was part of the plan. There's more. I heard enough for today. Excuse me, I have to go to take a shower. Virginia, Virginia, remember that beautiful cat I was telling you about? I want you to do some digging on his name. Now listen, his name was Manson. Man's son. Man's son. Man's son. Man's son. Was there a red barn? Uh-huh. The tape murders had taken place between midnight and one morning. Is that right? Charlie is love. Pure love. When you stab someone, it feels good. When the knife goes in. <laughs> there's more. There's more and more. And there's three people that came out of the desert. You can hear me on my death list. <laughs> Who's on it? Elizabeth Taylor, Richard Burton, Tom Jones, Steve McQueen, Frank Sinatra. I all know how they're gonna die. Did you see Zero before he died? One of the girls had been holding Zero's hand when he died. When the gun went off, he climaxed all over himself. I wasn't sure by the hair of Zero's death. I should be pretty excited. Imagine how beautiful it would be to be there. Oh, when it happened. I'm kind of shocked myself, to be honest. I should play Sexy Sadie in the movie. Sign me up.